Norgo Gallen, you're working with presidents, the Secret Service. Mm -hmm. Jimmy Carter was first. Tell us about right, that. Right, Jimmy Carter. Well, I, well, anytime you do a presidential thing, you're, or anything like that, you have to go through the Secret Service, and you have to be, you have to have clearance. And because I had to go to the White House and every place else, so you, you have top clearance. And um, but Jimmy Carter, um, we did the gala there, and that was in at the Kennedy Center, and. Um, but that was a, a lot of the people from Saturday Night Live were involved with that, you know, Chevy Chase and all these people. And it was, it was, it was a comedy show. It was historic, but it was the first time a gala had ever been done for a president. And it was very special. We were very honored to go be invited over to the White House afterwards for a party, his first party that he threw over there after his inauguration. And uh, no liquor. It was, uh, I think, beer, or I think beer. I don't even know wine was served, but it was, it was very, very, very nice, very nice. Different from the than the than the, than the, the uh, Reagan one, I'll tell you that. Now, you mentioned that there was a, some comedy, but you're still representing the country. You know, is there, talk, talk about the pressures of just the image and what this show much project to the people. I mean, you're not just putting another variety show on. No, not at all. The, the, it, well, first of all, if you're doing an inaugural, it's a celebration. That you can't, you're, you're not beating the horse. You're not trying to make goody points. You're, you're there honoring the person, and you have to keep that in mind no matter what you do. If it's a close friend, if they want to play, you know, say something that's that the, the person's not going to be upset with, that's probably cool. But they, there's so many people from the presidential committee there, they're going to make sure that there's not going to be anything that's going to be done wrong either. You know, because it, you, you, you're not there to, to embarrass somebody. You're there to, to celebrate, and you, you always have to keep that in mind. Then you did Reagan. How were the two um, presentations or productions different? Well, the, the Carter one is much more casual and laid back, and Reagan was more pomp and more lavish and uh, sp tried to be more spectacular. And, and, then, and with the multitude of military, multitude of musicians, multitude, just, just in scale what was done and, and that kind of stuff. And it was very, very impressive. 